Hi, it's Keith Townsend from CTOAdvisor.com with another CTO Coffee Chat. We're going to talk HPE's purchase of SimpliVity, the hyperconverged infrastructure or HCI vendor. SimpliVity is, you know, like for a better term, the second best known player in this independent HCI solution. Outside of the major vendors, obviously, HPE has traditionally had their HC250 solution, which was their first shot at hyperconverged infrastructure. Then they came out with the HC380, which is a more coherent product, but still a little bit behind their competitors when it comes to overall capability. And why should we care about this space? One of the questions I've been asking for the past six, seven months is, is HCI a standalone product category? Are we going to see the likes of Nutanix raise up to be the size or competitive independent company that will compete with VMware, EMC, Dell EMC, HPE, Cisco, or will we see Nutanix gobbled up? With a market cap at $4 billion, it'd be pretty Hard for one of the current providers to justify purchasing Nutanix based off of those sales. So what's the value of a Nutanix over a SimpliVity or other solutions? If you think about what they're doing from a, an investor perspective, they're, so, they're telling a great story. They're a platform that you can build your infrastructure on. Now, I question whether or not many enterprises will wholly embrace an all Nutanix landscape. I struggle with the concept of separating Nutanix's software from the hardware. It's kind of an integrated part. It's like an iPhone taking iOS and putting it on an Android device. Will it work? Yeah, it'll work, but the experience won't be the same. It's a integrated solution. So if you're an enterprise thinking about a all Nutanix play, the hardware and software kind of walk hand in hand. So if you don't have a need for a traditional three tier architecture where you have storage, compute, network, all separated and you're managing it with a abstracted layer such as Kubernetes and you want to replace that with a single architecture, which is Nutanix's platform, you know what? That's a compelling reason. But I don't know many enterprises that are in a position to make that type of commitment to a single hardware vendor. And I think that's one of the challenges I see with Nutanix's vision. But you know what? I don't have insider information. They may have something up their sleeve that I'm not seeing readily. So recap, great move by HPE. It'll take some time to integrate SimpliVity's platform into their synergy and composable infrastructure play which i think i i've already shared that i'm pretty high on that concept but overall i think it's a great move i think it's an indicator that in 2017 as i mentioned on the packet pushers podcast that 2017 is going to be the year of consolidation for hci i think the only standalone player left major player will be the nutanix of the world how much longer can they last until they come out with their complete vision? I don't know. We'll see. Talk to you guys next Coffee Chat. Follow me on the web at CTO Advisor on Twitter. And of course, please subscribe to the podcast. We're in iTunes, the CTO Advisor. Talk to you guys next time.